Hello students in this video we are going to discuss about vapor pressure and boiling point first we are going to start our discussion with vapor pressure so what is vapor pressure vapor pressure is the pressure exerted by the molecules in gaseous phase in equilibrium with its liquid at a specific temperature so students this definition sounds complicated so let me make it easy for you if we taking a liquid and is allowed to evaporate in a closed vessel the molecule escaping from a liquid surface do not leave the container so these are collected in a vapor state above the surface of the liquid so due to the evaporation liquid changes into vapors and level of liquid decreases after some time the level of liquid does not change further and becomes constant because at the final stage the rate of evaporation becomes equal to the rate of condensation so in such a case the system is not at a rest though there is no change in system because the amount of liquid level in the vessel does not change in fact the number of molecules which escape from the liquid to gaseous phase due to evaporation becomes equal to the number of molecules which return to the liquid from the gaseous phase so this state is called dynamic equilibrium at this point two opposing processes occur at a equal rate so the pressure exerted by molecules in a gaseous phase in equilibrium with its liquid is called vapor pressure of the liquid so students as you know vapor pressure is a characteristic property of a liquid at a given temperature so vapor pressure is directly proportional to the temperature students you must remember a liquid boils when its vapor pressure is equal to the atmospheric pressure so students this is all about vapor pressure now we are going to discuss about boiling point so what is a boiling point of a liquid boiling point is the temperature at which the vapor pressure of a liquid equals to the atmospheric pressure so when the atmospheric pressure is equal to the vapor pressure of water the water will boil boiling point depends upon the atmospheric pressure so at high altitudes atmospheric pressure is low that's why liquid at high altitudes boil at low temperature so at high altitude water boils at much lower temperature than in the plains next we are going to discuss about the effect of external pressure on boiling point normally at a standard condition water has a boiling point of 100 degree celsius variations in pressure have an effect on the boiling point of water if you increase the pressure the boiling point will increase because more energy will be needed to rises the vapor pressure to the increased atmospheric pressure on the other hand if you decrease the pressure the boiling point will decrease so students this is all about vapor pressure and boiling point thank you